Okay, today I am making tamale casserole. Um, I don't know why we call it tamale casserole because it doesn't um, taste like tamale at all, but it's just what I know. So there's what I have mixed so far. I took this can of crushed tomatoes, a can of drained and rinsed black beans, a can and drained of green beans, a can and drained of corn. I have prepared one box of Jiffy corn mix, according to the directions, a third of a cup of milk and one egg, just one. That's gonna go on top of this mixture that goes in there. I need to preheat the oven for 375. Start. Okay, I'm just gonna use one packet of taco mix added to this. That's going to be my seasoning. I'm not doing more than that because this is a leftover recipe. This was seal milled, seal milled taco mix um, from tacos that we had last week. So it's about, I don't know, about a half pound I'm going to throw in here. It's cold. It was frozen. I save all of my taco meat after taco dinners because they make chili or they make this or burritos or enchiladas whatever so we always save always save that and then we're going to give this a nice mix this is going to be thicker um smash this down this is a thicker recipe so you can add olives i've added olives i've added red kidney beans light and dark but so this isn't too watery once it bakes off with the cornbread um, I want it to be a little bit thicker. So when I come back, it'll be in the pan with the cornbread. I also have about a cup and a half of cheese that I'm going to put between the mixture and the cornbread. And that's it. This is like a five minute meal. Dump that in there. Yep. Just like that. Dogs, whoops. Doggies will get that. Um, and then take the, Ooh, let me get around you. Yeah. Okay. You can see, I'm going to spread this out just a tiny bit. You guys, this is just a dump recipe. It's so fast and you literally only kick it or cook it. Woohoo! I can't talk today. Cook it. Um, as long as the directions on the Jiffy, see, even this cheese is left over from taco night. Um, just cook it as long as the directions say on the Jiffy box. So this goes right on top of that. It's not a whole lot of mixture that goes on top. This is tamale pie. Or our version of it. Get all that because it makes a small amount. It'll spread out just kind of Give it a little help. Boop, boop, boop. And that's it. I'm going to bake it on 375 for probably 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, so I ended up baking this about 25 minutes because it's on something that's liquidy. It takes a little bit longer. So here's the finished product see it's nice and hot and cheesy see this over here and this ball Ooh. cheese and that's it our version of tamale pie